Hey, Joey Blue here, and I want to tell you about the sum function within the SQL language. So here we're selecting from the employee table, and we have 14 records. Well, what I want to do is I want to sum up the salaries. I want to know how much money we're spending on all these people. So what we want to do is use what's called the sum function, which will add all these up. And so we put sum, parenthesis, and then salary, and then from the employee table. So we execute this whole thing. And so we're spending $29,000 a month on all these people. Well, what if we want to know how much we're spending on managers? So we say where um, the job equals manager. And if we run that, we can see we're spending $8,000 on managers, $8,275 on managers. So let's head back over here for a second. And I want to throw in one little wrinkle here. What I want to do is, is I want to try to mimic the average function. And in order to do that, we talked about that in previous videos, but in order to do that, we're going to have to do two things. First, we want to um, sum the salary column. And we also want to, I'm um, we'll give it an alias. And then we also want to, um, we want to count the salary column. And so let's do that. Let's get rid of this manager there. And so we have a total salary that we've already seen of 29,025. And we have 14 rows. So now in order to do the average, we simply have to, and I'm gonna get a character turn in here so we can see it. We sum the salary, and then we divide it by the count of salary. Let's see what happens here. And our average is 2073. And shall we see if that's really what the average would come out as? So toss the average function in there. And yep, using the sum, we come out with the same thing. So that was the introduction into the sum function and we actually talked about the count and average, but really we're, we're focused on the sum, which is a function that's built into the SQL language.